Or Shane back to Dax Lowers. Clements sends a long one. Oh, that's a great stretch pass, making a two-on-one. Corshane in, sends it across. Oh, Ferrari eluded the stick, maybe not completely and utterly on the ice from the Blaze 29. And now here come Brayhead the other way. Jacob Doty sends one weakly on Nastyuk, and he will gobble. And that was a, a chance missed for the Coventry Blaze too. Yeah, a chance missed. Luke Ferrari, as you say, you probably want him to have his stick on the ice. So I think he was kind of anticipating that Corshane would probably have to saucer pass it up and over. So he was kind of half and half between having his stick on the ice and having his stick in the air. And it ended up really being a neither. Here's Lake. Dumps it in round. Hoping that Corshane would be able to get a, get a leg on it to pass it down. But... No dice, and the clan can come back. Oh, good touch off. That's fallen now for Dingle. Shoots! Oh! Off the inside of the pipe! That may have come out. It sprung out pretty hard, but Blaze fans thought that was in. They have to see that one slow down again. It was a really good strike from Ryan Dingle. Hayward battling with Ferrara. Ends up back with Lowers. Oh, that's a great pass ahead of Luke Ferrara. Space! Oh, and he puts it in! Luke Ferrara scored a similar goal in pre-season against Brad Day from about there on the ice. Tucks it inside the far pipe. That was a tremendous finish from the Blaze 29, and the Blaze lead 1-0. It's a fantastic cross-ice pass, and Luke Ferrara doesn't need a second opportunity there. Just puts it far side, straight past Ryan Nive, low into the bottom corner. The face off will come to the right of Ryan Knight. Jordan Petras scored a goal last night, had a couple of assists as well. He was indeed the Blaze man of the match. Valorand with the puck. Had two goals himself, Marco Valorand. As that one comes to Petras across. Valorand steps in, shoots! No mistake from Marco Valorand! His third of the weekend, the Blaze second of the night. The five on three not lasting very long at all, only 10 seconds. And the Blaze number 88 doubles the Blaze money in the first period. Some nice movement there from behind the net through Petrus to Marco Valorand. And he's got too much time and space there. That goes top shelf. Very nice finish from the Canadian forward. That is just a wonderful, wonderful release from Valorand. Bjorkland. He's on the left-hand side, dumped wide of Nasty Oak. McKenzie, good bounce off the back wall for him to shoot, but the shot was quite far wide. Bjorkland with a dipsy doodle to wrong foot Valorand. Oh, right in front! Oh, that's trickled through Kevin Nasty Oak. All the time and space in the world on the back door for the clan. And they'll get this game back to within one. Some nice pressure from the clan in the offensive zone. They cycle the puck down well on that left-hand side as we look at it. Puck comes forward. Adam Brace is there just tapping away. And eventually that puck falls in. Marco Valorant takes that one. And now the Blaze come north. As, uh, oh, Dingle gets yanked down. Glowers has a chance in front. Oh, and it's in the back of the net. With the net miles off. It's going to be a penalty for holding the stick. I don't think the goal's going to count. Controversy here at the Sky Dome. Maybe, uh, maybe they're going to watch the review. I'm not sure. Yeah, the, certainly the man's going to sit, sit in the box. So we, we have to assume that the goal's not going to stand, because otherwise that would be a delayed penalty goal. Well, let's take a look again. I mean, he's he's, abso he's absolutely hauled down. Yeah, there. that's it's a clear penalty. It's a clear penalty. Lowers comes in. I think the net was well off before the uh, the shot was taken. Mm. So that's a tricky one because the trajectory of the puck clearly was in I the mean, back of the net from Dax Lowers. If the net move, if the net moves while he's taking the shot, then that's a goal. Yeah, it is. If, he, if the net moves before he's taken the shot, then it then it's a two minute penalty. Or sort of their way through this blaze power play. Dumped round, Dingle gets swamped by Hayward. It comes to Robinson, leaves it back. Quick pass to Petrus. Steps in, thinks about the chance, shoots one to the back door, and oh, a diving save from Nyon Valorand. 
Robinson shoots one. Oh, and off the side of the net as well. Halfway through this man advantage. Blaze edging closer and closer to getting their two goal lead back. For Shane. Oh, cheeky pass. Jordan Petra steps in. Robinson, one time a good save, Ryan Knight. Well, that was Superman esque from Ryan Knight. But the Blaze are hurrying the play up. They might get a chance here, Ben Lake offside. Jeez Louise. The Blaze, I don't think, could have come any closer to scoring in this period. They've had one washed out, they've had one. That was absolute larceny from Ryan Knight. Really great save from the Brayhead netminder there. Pass down low for Valorand. Valorand harassed by Sescon. Gets it to Corshane. Sends it across to Dingle. Back to a play. Oh, he couldn't shoot. Wojtek Klaus coming in. Although, oh, that's a poor play from the clan. Number 16. Dingle in to the back door for Klaus. Nye with a save. They still have it in the offensive zone. Brooks pokes it away from Valorant. Now it's a two-on-one for the Brayhead clan. Chance, Brooks backhanded across and it's taken away out of the passing lane. Now here's Galen Patterson. Blaze want to hurry this play up as Venus and Patterson go two-on-two. End-to-end stuff. Patterson shoots saved by Nye. <laughs> Entertaining stuff in this passage of plays too. Both teams have chances. Puck ends up with Lowers. Softly ahead of Jordan Petrus. Ferrara spins in a bit of trouble, gets checked hard by Jacob Dotty into the bench. Lowers comes across and he gets offered by Jacob Dotty. Lowers just looks at him as the Blazer coming north. Big chance for Ferrara oh, for Venus. It's tapped under there and somehow it stays out again. I, I think maybe that came off the leg of Ross Venus. Here's Petrus as he crosses the blue line. It's checked into the boards by Sescon. They push and shove a little. Robinson couldn't get that one while diving. It's been a good penalty kill so far from the clan. Really disruptive. Hard pass forced to Corshane. Right down the gut of the ice. Adam Corshane drops it. Shot comes in just wide of the net. Corshane still with it to Robinson. Oh, it fell behind him. Chats there. It doesn't matter. It's converted by Petrus. And the Coventry Blaze get their two goal lead back. Boy, oh boy. They've had enough bites of the cherry stew. And they finally, it's the captain that converts. You thought that Brett Robinson was about to wind up and get it. But he just leaves the puck behind him. Puck comes across for Jordan Petras there. And in a very similar position to a couple of his goals already. Kind of in the docks. Taking the one-timer and sending it home. And so we'll have a... Clan player thrown out the dot as Mbak kind of encroached. Feisty game. Feisty game. Jacob Dott is certainly looking for something. He's still jabbing his stick there at Venus. I mean, he, at some point he's got to, yeah. yeah. He's going to give Jacob Dotty a penalty here in sportsmanlike conduct, perhaps. There's, there's very little reason. I mean, he's, if he wants to go for a, pl a Blaze player, then so be it. But Ross Venus is not the player to be attacking because yeah. you're you're not going to get a single. Oh, he's going to get thrown out the game here. I, now that's a bit too much. I mean, give it, give him a 10-minute misconduct and tell him to sit down, but uh, and calm off. But throw him out of the game. That's too much for me. Someone's chipped in ahead of Robinson. Schofield there as well. Big shove from Tyler Schofield. Chipped round for Robinson to chase. He'll get there first. Spins away from Schofield. Can't spin away from Sullivan. That one will come to the point though. Claus winds up, bats one through traffic, wider than it. Arnolov keeps it in. Shove into the corner on Lake. Lake turns away from Schofield. Good work from Lake. Tricky play. Oh, he tried to play it out for Dingle. Dingle still might get a chance. Puck on his stick. Spins away. Klaus has space. He'll have to play it around for Bebris as the passing lane disappears. Coming up to five minutes remaining. Shane shoots one looking for a tip from Dingle. Just wide. Klaus gets shoved into the wall. Still going, Wojtek Klaus. Puck comes off the leg of Hogarth. Valorand in there. Arnolov. Forced to Valorand. In front, backhand. Oh, that's a great finish. Ryan Dingle. A shovely backhand. And that gives the Coventry Blaze a three-goal advantage. And that might be just out of reach of the clan now. 